Assalamu alaikum and welcome to this video also welcome to easy coding with Amara and in this video I am going to show you how to upload a data frame using pandas so let's start first of all open the anaconda and if you want to run this program in the pycharm so you can use pycharm tool okay but in whenever you use pycharm tool you have to install this panda package on pycharm but in this uh, anaconda software you don't have to use the uh, to import pandas because pandas package is already present there but i I'll, i will tell you how to use this pandas in pycharm So this is the screen of Anaconda. Okay, click on this launch button of uh, Jupyter Notebook. So yes, this is the PyCharm tool. Okay, if you want to use pandas in PyCharm, you have two methods to import pandas library. Okay, first of all, if you want to if you don't want to use terminal then first then click on this file okay and click on this setting button go to your project and click on this project interpreter and click on this plus button and search here pandas So you can see this is the pandas and if you want to install this package then click on this install button okay simply this is very simple and if you want to import from terminal then write here pip install pandas and then click on enter so in this way you can install pandas package in the pycharm okay but i don't use this pycharm okay and because Whenever I use a new package, I have to install it and in this Anaconda, the packages are already installed. Okay, most of the package is already installed. But if you, if some package is not available on this Anaconda, you have to install it by going to environment, click on this icon and open the terminal, okay, and write the same command pip install pandas okay and then click on enter okay so in this way if you, if some package is not available on this software anaconda then you have to install it by using this terminal okay <laughs> so let's go and click on this new button create a new python 3 file So here we can write code very easily and if you want to entitle this so click on this button and rename it and then go to rename button okay but I don't want to change so I click on cancel button. So you know that whenever we use some package we have to import it so let's start and import pandas package. So as I don't want to use panda again and again so I I rename it like this PD so I use this PD in the short form okay if you want to use short form then you can rewrite it but otherwise if you don't want to use short name then remove it and use pandas okay also I want to import matplot library okay to use the plot function So similarly, similarly like PG, I don't want to use this mat like by plot again and again. So I use a short name M. Okay. Now let's create two columns. Okay, for data frame.
so here I am creating two columns name as marks and age okay and one I use for x-axis and one I use for y-axis okay one column I am using for x-axis and as you know that whenever we use whenever we plot a graph we we have used two axes x-axis and y-axis okay So before run this code, I have done a mistake like pd dot because this function is present in pandas. Okay, so so we have to write pd dot data frame. And uh, one more mistake is here column. Yeah. So here we have five rows, one, two, three, four, five and also we have to create equal rows so we want two three four five rows okay now let's start and uh, check the output so this is the graph okay and uh, in this graph we have created marks in the x-axis okay so here is the marks and uh, y is equals to age so y axis in the y axis we have ages or all the ages okay and if you want to change the kind you can also change the kind and if you i remove this kind so look at the graph so when i when i use a scatter a scatter type all the points are scattered okay so in this way you can plot a data frame okay so you can very easily plot a graph from the data frame in this way and in the next video i will tell you how to use a seaborn package in your uh, pycharm and also anacoda so let's practice this video and please like my videos comment and subscribe and also I will provide the link of my website in the description. See you soon. Allah Hafiz.